How to create a portfolio website using WordPress. Easy tutorial for beginners. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm giving you a tutorial on how to create a portfolio website using WordPress. So let's get started. First, what you guys need to do is you will go to wordpress.com and you will land on this platform right here. Wordpress.com is one of the most famous website builder and web hosting platform that allows you to create your own website and get your own domain. We can create websites in any of the niches. We can create portfolio websites, blogs, restaurant websites, business websites, any website we want. Today, I will show you how to create a professional portfolio website using WordPress. You need to sign in to your WordPress.com and you will get right here. So in our WordPress, we have to create a website and it's going to be very similar how we create a website. But the difference is in the theme and what we upload to our website. In a portfolio website, we create an about us page, a contact us page, and we want to build our portfolio. So first step is going to be selecting a theme. For that, you have to go to WordPress and then you will go to the appearance section here and click on themes. In themes, click on add new. So here we will find more than 5,000 themes available on WordPress for different niches and businesses. We also have portfolio, you know, templates available. For example, this one right here, we can get a preview and it will show us how the website will look like. So you can see this is a, a UI that focuses on the portfolio website and this is the, you know, template and it looks really good. We can embed our articles and other stuff. Okay, now I can can maybe check out the other ones we can also filter our search by going to the search bar right here and search for portfolio and it will show us the portfolio templates and themes but for a portfolio you can go with an ashtray and then we have this one right here this is the portfolio you know template so i'm gonna go with this one click on install and that theme will be installed and we will be able to use it this is also a ui and ux portfolio theme once it's installed, you will click on activate. So here we have our theme and you can see it looks really impressive. Of course, now we will customize our theme and it will allow you to customize your website. Now you need to add your post to your website. That's an important part, of course. When it comes to the adding post, what you will do is you will upload your work that you have done. To upload any of the post, click on add new and you will be able to upload a file. We can upload photos and videos to our portfolio. So if you have a business, let's say you are a, a property dealer, then you can add different reviews of your clients on your website. I'll show you how to add reviews. Uh, if you are an editor, if you deal in, you know, video production, you can add your video samples to your website. Then if you write blogs, you can embed articles uh, right here. So this is an important part that you will do customizing a website is really easy how we do it on wordpress like a simple customization we can customize the theme we can customize the header footer and there is already a video on the channel how to use wordpress or how to customize a theme but i'm showing you how to actually build a, a portfolio website so for that first you have to choose a theme which is portfolio theme and then you will add your post you will add your photo as well you will add the uh, you know upload videos and articles as i told you before you can also create different categories if you work in different niches in different categories what you can do is you can divide your work your you know different uh, testimonials into different categories with this section right here let me show you how to create a category on wordpress click on the category section you will add the name right here add the slug then you will select a parent category add the description and a new category will be created on your wordpress website so it's really important if you want to divide your work into categories then you can uh, create this then we have media this is where you will be uploading your images and this is where you Will upload your image so you have to add an image because it helps our viewers get an idea what we look like and i think adding an image is an important part to a portfolio website so i'm going to click on add new and select a file and we will just upload a image from our computer so i'm going to select this one the maximum size can be 100 mb 
there you go the image has been uploaded and i can now edit the image out i can add a caption we can add an alternative text to help with the seo so you can see the image has been uploaded and i will add it to my website similarly i can add more images like my clients or my company or i have a team so we can add them here we can also upload videos in the media section moving on i'll show you some of the plugins important plugins you need for your portfolio website so you will go to the plugin section here click on add new it will take you to add plugin so here we have add plugins and we're going to search for a plugin uh, known as content view this will allow me to add grid layout to my WordPress website. There is already a video on the channel, a very descriptive video on how to actually add a grid layout. So grid layout actually helps us to add our work, especially if you are creating a, let's say, photography portfolio. If you're creating a portfolio in which you have to show your work, show your images, then you can use the content view plugin then you need to add reviews so i'm going to search for a review uh, plugin so you will see just search for review it will show me the testimonials and review site reviews site review is a complete review management solution uh, widgets for google reviews if you run your business on google you have some of the google reviews you can add them to your wordpress website because adding testimonials and reviews are, is an important part of a portfolio website then we have photo reviews for WooCommerce. We have a WP TripAdvisor review. So this is one of the plugins that you need to add. Then we can go with a cover letter. So if you want to go with a cover letter, then you can actually add a plugin. It will not be shown every time, but you can add a plugin that allows you to generate your forums and that allows you to add your cover letters and different things. So you can see PDF generated for fluent forms, the contact form. So if you want to create a contact form for your uh, a portfolio website, which is again an important part because you want people to contact you, so you can create contact forms with WP forms or PDF generated for fluent forms. So there are different, you know, platforms out there to create forms you can even create a contact form on google forms if you do not want to go with the plugins so that totally depends on you and then you can add it to your wordpress portfolio website that you are creating then sometimes we also want to add appointment option to our portfolio website so what you can do is you can search for a plugin known as appointment and it will give you all of the option Appointment or booking WordPress booking plugin. You add this plugin and people will be able to book appointments on your WordPress website. If you run a business online or if you have a service that you provide, then you can, of course, add the booking to your WordPress website and it will help you build your portfolio. Other than that, the customizing of the theme, it's really easy and you can go ahead and check out another video on the channel to learn how to customize a theme. You will select a theme for your portfolio and then use all the elements that I just showed you, the posts that you upload, the media, and then you will be using the plugins you have added. You can create pages. When it comes to pages on your portfolio website, you will have an about us page. You will create a contact us page you will create testimonial page these are the most important pages for your portfolio website so once you have the pages you have the plugins you have the post then you can customize your theme to create a professional portfolio website using wordpress really easily i hope that i was a big help to you guys don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to youtube channel